And uh, this is a, a slide I like to show just to help you remember that fat trapping uh, can be seen in a variety of different entities. Only one of these is DFSP, and you might have figured out by looking at it, I mean, it is a bit more cellular, so this is the actual DFSP here. That over there is a, on the left, is a diffuse type neurofibroma. Here's a fibrous hamartoma in the center, and then there's real DFSP right there. So not always is fat trapping DFSP. Okay, so a few tips and pearls about that, like we just mentioned about the fat trapping. CD34 can stain a lot of different things, including neurofibroma. Most neurofibromas have quite a bit of CD34 expression. So if you're ever between diffuse neurofibroma and DFSP, add an S100 or SOX10 with your 34. It's extremely, I used to say never would DFSP be positive for S100 or SOX10, but you know, that's the problem. If you say never, eventually you'll get proven wrong. And I have in fact seen one, only one example. Uh, it was fibrosarcoma as DFSP, uh, translocation confirmed, and it had patchy, but very real S100 expression in the fibrosarcomatous areas. So it's still on my to-do list to maybe write that up as a case report one day, but I would say it's exquisitely rare. And again, if uncertain, um, you can use FISH for collagen 1A1 PDGFB. And uh, if that's negative, you can reflex the PDGFD. The, the most common time actually that I do FISH for DFSP is when I think it's probably not DFSP, but I've got a bland CD34 positive spindle cell lesion and a small biopsy. So I'm either gonna say this is benign, leave it alone, or I'm gonna say go back and do a big surgery. And so um, uh, I could also, I guess, just send them back to get me a bigger sample, but then sometimes I might still be uncertain about the diagnosis and then we've delayed care even longer and had an extra procedure in between so i feel like it's easier to just go ahead and do the fish and get the, the def, as close to a definitive answer as we can right off the the bat uh, at, on the biopsy so that's the way i handle those cases so so oftentimes when i send uh, fish for dfsp it comes back negative because the times i'm using it are uh, when i'm pretty sure it's not but i just want to be 100 percent or as close to 100 percent as we can be with these things